Hello. In this short video, I'm going to show how, at Triangle Learning Community Middle School, we will be using Google Earth on a regular basis to help students better empathize with events in the world that they will be learning about and studying. And we'll try to keep it real as well. So let's say, hypothetically, students um, at Triangle Learning Community Middle School were applying for a grant through Ashoka. And the grant was called Activating Empathy, Transforming Schools to Teach What Matters. And that seems like a good grant because the, the goal of Triangle Learning Community is to create empathetic global citizens. So let's say further, hypothetically, that one of the judges is Kieran Beersethi, who gave a tremendous TED Talk describing um, how in 2001 she founded the Riverside School in Ahmedabad, India. Now, if you're a typical middle school student, you have no idea where Ahmedabad, India is, and you might not even have a good sense of where India is on a world map. So what Google Earth allows us to do is to go into Ahmedabad and see where it is. And so this is a river. This is the large city of Ahmedabad. And somewhere, presumably from the name, um, on the side of the river is the Riverside School. Now, it happens that the Riverside School is pretty well known. And if you type in Riverside School, Gujarat, India, Google Earth takes a couple guesses at what you meant. And it turns out its first guess is correct. And this is the location of the Riverside School. And if you wanted to tell a story, I'm just going to close this link for a second there. If you wanted to tell a story down the road about it, you could add a place mark. And we'd call it Riverside School. And we'd make sure the place mark was right where we wanted. Maybe we're talking about this part of the school. And we could save it. We could also add media to it. So if we went to the TED Talk and grabbed the URL of it, control C, paste it in here. Now, if I'm telling somebody about Riverside School, I can click on this link, which will take me to the TED Talk. We could watch the eight or nine minute TED Talk and generate all sorts of questions about the school. And we might now use Google Earth to say, wow, where do these kids come from? What is this river like? What is this housing settlement like over here? And what is this sports arena? And students, because we're using Google Earth and they can picture it far better they can pick, than they can just picture the word Ahmedabad, um, it starts to come to life for them. And they start asking better questions and they start empathizing um, with, uh, with Riverside School and with India in general. So here we would take them out to see India, see that it's divided into various states, just like the United States is. And this is the state of Gujarat. And there are other states within India as well. India has about 1.2 billion people. That Triangle Learning Community will make it a point to constantly give students pieces of global context, um, such as various world populations, and let them sort of sink in, huh, we could maybe use Riverside School to think about how does that fit within the overall context of India, within the overall context of uh, Asia, perhaps. So this is an example of how, using Google Earth, we can better empathize with the world, and we'll make pretty regular use of Google Earth. I would say three, four times a week, we'll start our day at Triangle Learning Community Middle School by reading the news and locating um, various news stories in Google Earth. I've been doing this for about four years. And as you can see, I have a lot of place marks. And I've greatly expanded my global worldview um, by using Google Earth to better empathize with the world. Thanks for watching this short video.